Bitcoin tips. So today we're going to be taking a look at one of the simplest ways that you can start mining cryptocurrency today using the computer that you are already owning. So before we get into the video, per usual, I do like to start off here on CoinMarketCap, taking a look at what's going on in the crypto markets as a reference if you are watching this video in the future. So taking a look here, as you can see uh, down in the corner, it's October 19th, about 8.40 p.m. Uh, and overall, crypto has gone up a little bit today. Bitcoin relatively steady, uh, you know, up about 1%, 1 1.2%, 28,680. Overall markets are up about 1%, just under, uh, which is really nice to see. Um, as you can see, Ripple really uh, kind of helped boost that up with a 7% gain today. So that's super cool to see if you own Ripple, but. Um, yeah, so with that out of the way, let's jump in. And before we jump into the site and program that we're going to be talking about today, I do want to take a minute to uh, say if you would like to follow my channel here on Rumble, uh, this is a great place to stay up to date with all of the Bitcoin tips content and ensure that if anything ever does happen to this YouTube channel, the videos are posted here as well. So the link is down below for that, as well as the link for nice hash so if you aren't familiar with nice hash you know definitely make sure you go check it out uh, down below uh, it's a great program a great site with tons of ways that you can earn cryptocurrency so starting off of course nice hash they are a mining company um, you know at heart they have you know, a windows miner they have a linux miner and then they also allow you to hook up your rigs uh, through other code and, and things like that um, which we probably won't get into too much in depth uh, but if you would like to see a video on that let me know down below um, so first off usually what most people will do uh, if you're using a windows computer all you have to do is download the nice hash miner program it will prompt you to sign into your account i've already done so here on this uh, instance but as you can see name worker one and my devices uh, my my ryzen processor and my nvidia gpu uh, neither of which are running at the moment uh, i can do a benchmark on either of them which what this will do is run through all of the uh, algorithms so right now there's one of one uh, algorithm that will run on the CPU and seven enabled algorithms on the GPU. So what it'll do is it'll actually run through, determine your speed at each of those algorithms and automatically mine the one that is most profitable for you. There's very little work that you have to do. Like I said, you just, once you have an account and download this, all you do is sign in with the same email and password and you can really just hit go. Now. As you can see, it brings up this uh, XMR miner. This is the one uh, XM rig. It's the miner that it's chosen as the fastest. I, I'm actually not sure if this one is mining. Let's see if it tells me if it's using, well, I can hear the fans uh, spinning up. So I'm guessing it's using the CPU. Um, whoops, that was a wrong button. But uh, I did want to pull up task manager just to show you that this program, it is actually mining. Um, I don't know what's happening there, but uh, it is actually mining. So it is going to pin your CPU and eventually GPU. It's that's what it's doing is it's doing the benchmark. Um, but as you can see here, it is set my CPU at 100%. So this will make your computer run slower and hotter. So that is something to keep in mind. And now I'm going to stop this because you know I am recording the video. But as you can see real quick before it refreshes in the background here, it did update to one active rig, which would be the computer that I'm recording this video on, that quickly. So first off, we're, what, four minutes into the video here, and it is that simple to mine cryptocurrency using your computer. Now, of course, with mining, as always, make sure you have proper ventilation for your computer, proper power supply, uh, you know, proper cooling, all of that, because this is going to make your computer run hotter. You most likely won't be able to or won't want to do anything else on the computer because it will be pretty slow. All of your computing power is being used to mine cryptocurrency. And of course, it does pay out in Bitcoin. 
everything shows up in your account here uh, in Bitcoin, which is super nice. Regardless of the program that you're mining, the coin that you're mining, it all gets paid to you in Bitcoin. So whether you like that or not, uh, I think it's a nice feature. You don't have to deal with you know little amounts of coins that maybe you're not interested in. You just get the Bitcoin. Uh, you can then do whatever you want with it from there. Now, with that being said, uh, like I said, here's a little bit more detailed version of the miner uh, mining page. I'll just skip the tour. Um, they do automatically pay out uh, Bitcoin to your default wallet address as long as you have at least 1,000 Satoshis. And I don't remember exactly how often they do it, but the next one is in three hours. So that's a nice feature as well. You don't actually have to come on here and you know, withdraw your earnings. It just automatically goes to your wallet. Um, and as you can see, this is my uh, rig that I was just mining from. Here's some of my uh, active worker uh, benchmarks and, and kind of where it would expect me to be earning. My unpaid balance, it looks like I maybe earned a little Satoshis there when I was just running it, which is super nice. But um, yeah, so like I said, you can download your miner up here or get the configuration uh, for Linux or an ASIC if you have an ASIC device. Uh, nice hash OS here, that third option down, that is the uh, Linux version. So if you are a little bit more hands-on with your mining rigs, that's a nice way to go as well. And then of course up here we can see the nice hash quick miner and the nice hash full miner for Intel as well super super cool um, you know it's very very simple to get mining now if you're not really interested in mining with your computer slowing it down creating heat increasing your energy bill all of those things that come along with mining they have a hash power marketplace which you can use to invest in what is essentially cloud mining using other people's computers um, so it's super cool. You can actually purchase the different uh, speeds, or if you wanted to, you could sell your speed back in basically by mining through the mining program. So kind of a cool way to go about it. Um, you know, like I said, you have you know enable buying. Currently, it's disabled on my account. I'm not huge into uh, you know mining and, and purchasing it here but it is something that I do like to mention if you don't want to do your mining on your own computer um, so in addition to that they also have easy mining which is basically just buying a mining package with a uh, chance that it's going to pay out uh, basically your solo mining uh, they've set it up to where you can get the package uh, for a certain amount of crypto and you would be solo mining hoping to hit that lucky block reward Of course, you will get a little bit more than if you were mining on your you know pool or, or however else you would be setting it up But it is nice that they do offer this as an option So super super cool. Um, they do also have you know some nice hash uh, merchandise if you're interested in that but really like I said, if you are looking to get into mining your own Bitcoin, and of course, like I said, you aren't actually mining Bitcoin, but other cryptos that pay out in Bitcoin, this is the easiest way. Um, I mean, you could really have this up and running in 10 minutes or less. Um, so if you're looking to get into mining, this is the great a great way to start. Uh, and like I said, as you expand in your mining operation, if you do get into more specific built mining rigs, NiceHash OS is a great way to go as well. So again, the link is down below in the description. I highly recommend you check it out if you're looking to get into mining. So thank you so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed and please make sure you like, share, and subscribe to Bitcoin Tips to stay up to date on all the latest things going on in cryptocurrency. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.